G'day all, it's Colin from PCTLC, thanks for joining me. Today we're going to take a look at um, something I've been trying to do for a while, is uh, write Ferran OS to a USB with UFI support. So you can do it with Rufus, I did install Rufus but I couldn't get it going with Wine. I think I'm doing something wrong, I haven't used Wine for a while. So what we're going to do, I've found another option, another another writing option. So first of all, go to Gparted. Now the USB that I've got in there is already booting with the UEFI. I'm going to wipe it clean in Gparted. I'm going to unmount it first. Going to format to FAT32. Let's wipe that uh, USB clean. Now manage flags. We'll do that later. So normally what you can do is, this is the other way, format to FAT32, apply. If that doesn't work, you've got something on there a bit stubborn, just go device and create partition table and MS-DOS and apply. So what we're going to do now is manage flags, boot and LBA. Close that. Right, our USB stick is now ready. So what we're going to do now is go to the software center or software manager, software manager. Type ISO. And your first search is Furious ISO Mount. Going to install that. Okay, that's installed. We're going to run Furious ISO mount. Just type ISO. Open that up. Select image. We're going to browse for our downloaded Ferran ISO. That one there. And we're going to click mount. So the mount point is home, colon, Ferran OS. So we go to there. Ferran OS, there it is. Right click and show hidden files. Right click this, go to places and open up. Um, oh, it doesn't matter what you open up really. Home. And we go to our 16 gig stick in my case it's 16 gig just make sure show hidden files are selected copy all that copy and paste so we're copying and pasting onto the usb That's my 16 gig USB volume now.
Okay, so I'm done. That's it. It's finished. So I'm going to switch over to my mobile phone and um, film the rest, putting it into my other computer with UEFI. UEFI. Okay, sorry if the uh, the video quality is not the best. So I'm just going to eject my USB. That's been ejected. So we'll take that out. And we shall put it in here. Okay, so I'll start them up. You need to press F10 to F10 button. And there we have UEFI. My silicon power. UFI USB. Can't see that top one. Start Farron OS 64 bit. Sorry for the quality and the shaking. And then we have Ferron OS booted up in UEFI support. Second screen is the welcome screen. So that was Ferron OS uh, writing to USB with UEFI support. We'll just unmount this disk. Click on the mount point, unmount, and that's done. So I hope uh, that was uh, hope somebody found that uh, useful and thank you for joining me.